My name is Kenny, and uh, today I'm going to be showing you how to set up Windows XP for your teleprompter. Today we're using a non-internal reversing monitor, which is the standard setup for most teleprompters. And I'm going to start this by right-clicking on the desktop, and that'll bring up this sub-menu uh, with a lot of different things on there. And we're going to go to the properties, and that will bring up the display properties menu and uh, that has a lot of tabs on it and we're going to concern ourselves with this last tab here the settings tab and that gives us a lot of information uh, but the main things we're going to concern ourselves with here is the screen resolution and the color quality we're going to make our screen resolution to be 1024 by 768 by adjusting this slider here and you can see the boxes up above resizing accordingly we're going to make that 1024 by 768 and the color quality, we're going to adjust that to be 16-bit. And we adjust monitor number 2 by clicking on that. You can see the highlight changing over to monitor number 2, and then making the screen resolution there to be the same as number 1. 1024 by 768, and the color quality again to be 16-bit. Number 1, we're going to use that as the primary device always, and number 2 is just an extension of my Windows desktop and so that is going to be checked here. Now you're going to have one long desktop that extends over both of your monitors. If you could look on monitor number two and see your icons then you are in a clone desktop mode. I'm going to apply this now and I can check it by clicking on identify and a number one is going to pop up in my main monitor and a number two is going to pop up in the teleprompter and of course, uh, since we're seeing it in the glass, it's going to be uh, reversed. We're going to fix that once we launch the software. I can close this menu now, I'm hitting OK, and going up to my Start menu and finding FlipQ and launching the FlipQ software. And FlipQ has noticed that now I do have a secondary display and it's checked my box for me. We're going to make that mirrored. And so that's going to solve the looking in the mirror issue. Uh, my primary display is going to be normal. I like using the show cue marker. Puts a little green arrow on the left side of the screen to kind of give you a point where the talent is going to be reading at. If I go up here to the big lightning bolt and put it into the presentation mode, it does a little bit of rendering. The text, I can see it scrolling up from the bottom. If I look in my teleprompter, I'm getting the same image over there. And now when I look at it in the glass, it is correct. And that's the basic setup for Windows XP using a non-internal reversing monitor.